Hey up YouTube, Ryan Pultra, the Oxford Filmmaker here and today I'm going to be going through what lenses I use when I do shooting of music videos and photography and absolutely anything and I only use four lenses at the moment. Uh, I use the 50mm which is also known as the Nifty 50 which every photographer, cinematographer should have in their lens bag. I also have the 14mm lens which isn't mine but uh, I borrowed it from a friend and uh, I need to give him it back at some point in the foreseeable future but I've had it for about a year now. Um, but yeah, absolutely amazing lens, I'll go into that a little bit more and a good old telephoto lens, 70-300mm Sigma and these are the lenses I use on a daily basis so let's go through each one Oh, and the 24 105mm, yeah of course, the one that you're watching me on now Duh. Uh, but before all that, roll those titles BOOM! First thing I want to say is always keep your lenses safe in a box. Now this box has gone through some battering. It's uh, it's broken at the front there. It's come apart at the side where I've had to fix it. I'm going to be purchasing a new one at any time soon. Um, but at the moment, this is keeping my lens safe. Now, as you can see, it must be doing a decent job because whatever's banging across it, and none of these have actually got any damage on them. So fingers crossed that this is working but I will be getting a new one and this is just an old com cosmetic box that my sister had that she was going to throw out and I'm like no no I'll use that so that's what I keep my lenses in so let's go through these lenses one by one so first of all the nifty 50 now the nifty 50 is one that every single person should have in their bag whether you're a photographer whether you're a videographer cinematographer however you want to call yourself filmmaker everyone should have the 50 mil the 50 mil is absolutely amazing for some shots that you can get i'm going to show you a few shots that i've taken with this uh, lens for video i've used it a lot for, uh, for music videos because it is absolutely amazing you can knock it to 1.8 you can have a light on in the background and have some amazing lens layers working with it i used it for the represent music video for uh, Hassan Ditter, so uh, a couple of uh, shots from that there and uh, you know absolutely stunning lens uh, and it only cost me £90 as well so for a 90 quid lens it looks and tacky it's it feels tacky but it's probably one of the best lenses I've had fast um, thing you can see it's a little bit of a batter into it as well um, because I've had this a long time this lens it's probably one of the first lenses I bought with this um, when I got before anything else I've had a lot of lenses and this was one of the first and it's one that's always kept inside of my lens um, box and it's always going to be used absolutely stunning lens so here's a few little snippet shots using the 50mm lens <laughs> Right, so moving on, this is the 70 to 300 millimeter lens. Now I've used this a lot for photography mainly. I use it for weddings when I've got a second camera because I use the uh, 24 to 105 mil on my, as my first camera. I use this as a second and I can get some amazing shots. Ideally, I'd love to have a 35 mil as my main or, or an 85 mil as a main camera and then use this as a uh, as my second camera lens. Uh, but that's not the way that I use it at the moment because um, I don't have the money to <laughs> go out and just buy a brand new lens like an 85 mil but one day maybe I will but this uh, 70 to 300 millimeter lens is absolutely amazing not only does it have a built-in macro for 200 to uh, 300 mil it's got a normal lens it's uh, it's it's absolutely beautiful and um, you know it's Sigma don't get mentioned as much as I think that they should do and it's not an L series but you know it does the job and it, I've used this a lot for doing a lot of um, my sports photography uh, so here's some shots that I was using it for the sports photography I've taken photos of uh, the likes of Colin Doyle who was a Bradford City goalkeeper uh, as well as uh, Gary um, Jones who's an ex-city player a lot of other football players that I've used taken of this if anyone ever watches Emma Dale or uh, see Tiny Tim or anything like that on Facebook I've got photos and that they've all been taken on this lens right here absolutely amazing lens perfect for weddings because you can Zoom, you can stand back, you can zoom in, you'll be able to get the um, close-up of the fingers for the ring, you can get the close-up of these kisses and you know, absolutely amazing lens and this again, with one lens I would say, and this one would only cost me £110, it's probably cheaper than that now as well because I've had this a long while, but absolutely amazing lens. Um, 
I, I also use it for uh, for footage because you can get get back, you can get close up, and you get some really nice depth of field with these sorts of uh, telephoto lenses. So yeah, definitely. Now, what I'll suggest is if you were starting out, get a 70 to 300 mm lens like this. Um, you can also get a cheaper version, which is from the Canon, but I think it's only an EFS lens uh, for uh, about about 90 to 100 pounds. And oh, hello, Molly. You get for about 98 to 100 pounds, um, and you can use that one. Uh, get a 28 to 105 millimeter lens, which is the under version for the 24 to 105 mil. And with those, you can get some amazing shots. Absolutely amazing. Now this lens, 14mm, it's uh, it's got a, a manual um, f-stop on it, it's from 2.8 to 22 which is absolutely amazing for this lens. This uh, this I haven't actually bought, this I borrowed from uh, a friend of mine uh, at AOP Vision, uh, Harry. He, uh, I need to give him this back at some point, I kind of don't want to give him it back because this lens is not one that I use on an everyday basis but the lens, the, the quality and the stuff that you can get from this lens is just absolutely fantastic. Now, you know, some of the stuff that you look at and you're like, what, what, what do you mean, what can you get? Well, I don't use it for photography. If I was to use it for landscape, it would be this lens. This is the reason why. This is a photo I took at Yeadon Tarn when I was shooting the music video, because I was using this for a music video with uh, Hassan Data and Shades for uh, their music video, Hit Them Up, which is coming out soon. So yeah, this this lens. Oh, I, I, can't, even, I can't even explain it. I just have a look, this is, this is what it looks like. And like I say, I, I wouldn't have thought of, you know, I'm going to take a photo, let's use a 14mm. But this is using the 14mm. Uh, this photo is going to take, again, Eden Tarn. Absolutely stunning photo, one of the best photos I've ever taken. And, you know, it, it, was, it was an accident to take it as well. So there we go. <laughs> Finally, the 24-105mm lens, which is the one that's on the camera at the moment. This is my workhorse lens. This is the one that I use most of the time. Um, one of the main reasons is, especially when I'm running and gunning, I want to try and get a lot of stuff done really quickly. This lens goes from 24mm to 105mm. It's a f4, so it can get in. It's, it's not as good as having like a, a 2.8 like this one, or a, a 1.8 like the uh, 50mm but I can get some decent stuff with it. And, you know, especially when I'm at weddings, I've got this one on uh, the 5D Mark IV, which I'm shooting on now. I have this one on the 5D Mark II. This I can get all the close-up shots quick and done. This one I use all of it, and you know, it is an amazing lens for that. And it's a perfect lens for one that, again, like I say, run and gun, I would prefer to be able to grow and say, look, let's get a, uh, a 24 or 70 mil. Um, or even have an 85mm prime, but at the moment I can't afford to do something like that. But, you know, there's always hoping. So these are my lenses and uh, what I use on a daily basis. If you liked this video, hit the like button, um, share it if you can, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Adios, see you later. Boo -boo. Okay, that was stupid.